Hello again, and welcome to Uncle Jeff's Easy Peasy English. Today, we're looking at compound adjectives. What, you say? What adjectives? Compound adjectives. For example, she was an attractive red-haired woman. Uncle Jeff is a good-looking man. Well, the furniture in the house was quite old-fashioned. I saw a broken-down car on the motorway. Compound adjectives, usually made up of two parts. Old-fashioned, good-looking, joined together usually by a hyphen. Good-looking, old-fashioned. Have a look at Uncle Jeff's board. Here are a couple more examples. Have a look at the first sentence. You can see this vase's hand and wasn't produced in a factory. What's the missing participle? My office is air, so it's very cool even in the summer. And the last one, I want to get my eyes tested. I've become very short lately. So what are the missing words? All of them compound adjectives. It could be a past participle with an ed ending. It could be an ing, present participle ending. What do you think? Have a look again. You can see this vase is hand and wasn't produced in a factory. Hand made. Lovely. You can see this vase is handmade and wasn't produced in a factory. Have a look at the second example. What do you think? My office is air, so it's very cool, even in the summer. It's, it is. My office is air conditioned. Correct. Air conditioned. My office is air conditioned, so it's very cool, even in the summer. And the last one, I want to get my eyes tested. I've become very short lately. Again, all of these very common compound adjectives. All of them describing the nouns. Handmade, describing the vase, air conditioned, describing the office. My eyes, I need to get my eyes tested. I've become very short sighted. Well done. I've become very short sighted lately. So there we are. English grammar, compound adjectives, they are easy peasy. Thank you for watching. Tell your friends. And we'll see you next time on Uncle Jeff's Easy Peasy English. Bye-bye for now.